all right guys so um welcome to my video and in this video i'm going to show you how you can create a website for free and you can even install wordpress on this particular um website so trust me when i say everything is for free i mean the domain name um the hosting and everything you even get a free c panel and um so if you're new to this channel my name is chris and what i do here is i teach you how to get um things you probably pay online you get them here on my channel for free or you learn how to get them here for free so if you want to be part of a family you can just subscribe to the channel and if this video in the long run is helpful you can just like this video and let's just get right in right so the first thing you want to do right now is to go on to google and search for this um website called infinityfree.net right so i'm just gonna do this again and i tap um infinity free dot net right so when i search for that this um result here this first result infinityfree.net is where you're actually going to um click right so you can say it says um, free web hosting with PHP and um, um, my um, SQL, right? So I'm just gonna click on that. So when I click on that, it's gonna load and take me to this um, section, right? So I actually have um, an account with this particular guy, right? So I don't need to register again, but I'm just gonna show you the whole registration phase so you can actually see how this works, right? So I'm just gonna click on this. Um, so you're actually asked to put in your email here, your password, you confirm your password and you sign up, right? So it's that simple. So what I'm just going to do right now is just to sign in and, um, sign in my account. So I'm just going to put in my password here. So get me logged in I click on sign in. So what happened is I actually have, um, I have um some um a website here created already right so this particular website i don't think it will be active anymore because i've uh it's been a while i use i use this particular website let me just see if it's active all right so this website is not active but anyways it's been a long time i use this so i guess what they do is if they notice the website is not active for this particular um, amount of time they just tend to put it off right so what i'm just going to do right now is just create a new one and you will see for yourself how i'm going to do this right so once you um create an account it's um first time it takes you to this home page let's just go to the home page right so i think where these guys actually make that money from is true advertisement so the fact that they are offering this for free and you tend to assess that website and probably you click on ads and i think that's where they make their money from so what you just want to do right now is to come here and click on create account so i'm just going to click on create account and so you can see other section here is asking for subdomain or custom domain so let me say i actually have a domain i've actually bought from somewhere and i want to use this guy's hosting service or that free hosting yes so i can actually do this but i don't have a, a domain so i'm just going to come here and just write let me say i want to create a website about how to make money and i'm just going to come here and say okay make money sorry make money um um green right so i think this works so you can come here what they do is they give you a domain extension that you can actually use right so it's either so let me explain this right so with this um domain subdomain extension you can actually use any of these that makes sense to you right but what i use personal is this dot for the two web that i right because this makes sense compared to dot free done done um nf so what i'm just going to do is um dot um for two web dot io so i'm going to click on that right like i said if you have a constant custom domain you can actually just do this but trust me this still works and you can still get google adsense on your website or you can still get your website monetized or whatever i want to use it for others can still access it so so i'm just going to come here and check for availability let me see if this is available all right so the domain um the domain make money green dot for two web dot io is available right so what i'm just going to do right now is to um um enter a account label okay websites for make money going so what i'm just gonna 
do so i'm just gonna come here and put this short description probably anything that you feel like putting on here so uh uh i'm just gonna come the best way to make money online as a student that's just my description and this can work for you right so account username this is generated automatically so you don't have to do anything about this right so the account password right so you can actually um generate the password for this particular account but i'm just gonna do my thing uh all right so i'm just gonna do my thing and just put my password here and see if that works uh, so create account All right, so my account has been created. So there's one thing I want you to take note of, right? Um, your account has been created with the username, and you don't need to take note of this anyways. Once you log in your account, you actually have an access to your account already. So you don't need to take note of this username here. So here are some things you need to know. It will take a few minutes for your account to be set up, but you can log into Control Panel already. Uh, it can take up to some two hours for the new domain to be visible everywhere due to DNS catching. So this is the part I wanted to focus on, right? So once you create your uh, your your website, right? So for you to be able to access that website, it takes about for two hours. Sorry, not for two hours. Seven two hours to actually access that website. So what I'm just gonna do right now is to go to my control panel. Um, um just access my control panel. So I'm just going to, I approve. All right, so let's just wait for this to load. All right. So I will just show how you can actually install WordPress on this particular um, seal panel that you are given, All right? So let's just wait for it to load. All right, so what I, uh, you can see it has all the primary things in normal cPanel um, platform we have. It has the file, the file manager. Let me say probably you don't want to actually use this for um, um, for a WordPress website. You can come here and install your script or upload your files or whatever it is, right? So I'm just going to come here to this um, Substaculous um, Apps Installer. I'm just going to click on this, right? All right, this is starting to allow to then try again later. Let me see if I click on this. All right, so this is something I want you guys to take note of, right? So with this particular um, stuff, like I said, it's still trying to propagate properly. So let me just reassess this again. Let me see if this works. Let me refresh this. Let me see if this is going to work. All right. But trust me, this whole stuff works, right? So let me try assess this again. Let me see if this is going to work. Or oh, we just have to wait for that 20 minutes. All right. So we have to wait for 20 minutes, right? So, but while we wait for that 20 minutes, let me just tell you how this works, right? So when you come here, you actually, once this opens up, you have the option to um, install WordPress. So once you install WordPress, you'll be giving your, um, your, um, WP admin details and all of that. You can create those details yourself. Like you create the WP admin password, username, and all of that. And trust me, this actually works the same way a normal paid platform is gonna work. But the only difference is that um, with this particular uh, WordPress, you won't be able to install those bulky, bulky teams you actually will on a normal hosting platform, right? And um, trust me if you just want to have a simple website that it's fast and running and accessible by everyone or probably just a website you just want to have and um, get monetized for our things and make money off you can actually use this method but if you want something more sophisticated uh you this whole option might not actually be best for you right so you might just actually want to stick to getting um a professional um, um domain name and an hosting for your website right but if you want something that is accessible online and you can submit to google and um is a good way to make money for you you want to actually try this method right so this is how you can actually create a free website um online with a free hosting regardless of your location and regardless of where you are right now so if this video was helpful i want you to smash the subscribe 